if you're trading with MetaTrader 4, you probably are having trouble like calculating the risk that you put in on each specific trade. I know there's a lot of people using CTrader or even web-based platforms in order to calculate how much is it that you're going to be investing on each position. But in this specific video, I'm going to show you how you can calculate the risk percentage on your uh, MetaTrader 4 trading platform. Hi everyone, this is Christian here on YouTube and welcome to a brand new video for the channel. If you've been having issues with MetaTrader 4 in order to calculate your profits and you wanna use this, this specific platform because it's suitable for your phone or because it's available worldwide, then this video is for you. I'm gonna teach you exactly how you can calculate your risk percentage with MetaTrader 4. But if you're new in my channel and uh, you're into binary options, Forex trading, crypto trading, or any type of making money online, this channel is for you. Make sure you hit that subscribe button below and activate the notifications bell icon so that you get a notification for every new video that I upload. With that being said, let's jump into the video. Alright everyone, so I'm over here on my MetaTrader 4 trading platform and uh, I'm going to share with you, I'm going to put it in the link in the description, uh, a website. I'm not affiliated to that website, but it's exactly the easiest way to find that I found in order to show you how you can manage your risk percentage. And is this website right here. I'm putting the link, it's earnforex.com I think, and it's a position size calculator that you're gonna use for MetaTrader 4. They also have it for MetaTrader 5. You can download it 100% free, okay? So that's the first thing that you gotta do, get this, uh, this specific file. Then you're gonna open it, it's gonna open on a, a compressed file. Then all you need to do is extract two, and uh, in my specific case, I'll just go ahead and hit OK so that it can get extracted into my downloads. Now on your downloads, you will see this specific file. All you need to do is actually double click on it and double click on it again. And you will be able to find this. This is the MQL4 source, uh, source file. And you, all you need to do is copy it like this. And then you're going to go to your broker and or to your platform, you're gonna go to tools, I'm sorry, you're gonna go to file and you're gonna open data metal, uh, data folder, then MQL4 and indicators. And you're gonna paste it right here. If you missed any of those steps, rewind the video and watch it over and over until you get it, okay? Now in the indicators tab, I'm gonna click on refresh and I'm gonna find it right here, position size calculator. So if you drag it and paste it on any specific uh, chart that you have available, let me see. Uh, let me just go ahead and attach the chart. And I'm sorry, make sure that you copy all of them, okay? Otherwise it's going to give you an error. So just copy everything and just paste it over there on the uh, open data folder in MQL4 and indicators right here paste it yeah replace the destination and now you can go ahead and refresh again the indicators so now it's actually ready so you drag it and you paste it or right click it and attach to the chart and last thing that you gotta do uh, before you actually drag it is to compile the file so in order to do that what you can do is just go to the same indicators and double click on the actual file and once you double click on it it will bring you this and all you need to do is click on compile and it shows no errors whatsoever and then you're actually ready to drag it you can get it on any uh pair that you want on any uh, uh window that you want to do it all you need to do is drag it or attach to the chart as you can see these are the common the inputs and bunch of things you don't really need to change anything you just hit okay and now you have a calculator for your chart how is it that it works in the main tab what you need to do is first choose what type of position you're going to be having so for instance right now there is a sell position let's assume that this is a good entry point obviously it went down a little bit more but it's a short position. Now, here, you're going to choose the stop loss, okay? How is it that you're gonna uh, uh, choose the stop loss? 
This is a matter of the training that I'm going to give you on uh, how to use it on this specific indicator, which is the VLWFX tool. But let's assume that your take profit, uh, your stop loss is actually 90450. That's the uh, stop loss. And the take profit is 9000. And then here in this part is where you are going to put the risk percentage. So if you want to risk 5%, you're going to enter uh, 5.00 or 5 and click anywhere outside. And it's going to tell you what is the actual, this is your balance. First of all, this is your balance right here your current balance in your broker. And here you put the risk percentage and uh, it's going to tell you how many lots you're supposed to enter, what position size you're supposed to enter. So right here, it's 0 0.15 lots. That's what you need to enter if those are your settings, okay? Now let's assume that you wanna risk uh, 2%. So 2%, you click outside and now your lot size has changed to zero, I'm sorry, to zero, 0.05. Does that make sense? So that means that that percentage, that risk percentage that you're risking is based on the stop loss that you're setting up. So now all you have to do is actually enter your order. So you can just click a new order and now you know, okay, so if, since I'm going to be entering my take profit at 904, uh, my stop loss 904050. Now my take profit is at 900 or 9, uh, 9,000. Then that means that my lot size should be 0 0.06. And there I'm actually risking 2% on my balance. It's pretty simple, right? It's pretty straight to the point. It doesn't really need that big of explanation. You can play around with all of these, but all you're gonna do, need is actually this, uh, the, the one that I'm showing you right now, the main one, and that's pretty much it. Now, if you wanna do a buy position, it's exactly the same. So you hit okay, you put it in the chart, and let's say that you take profit right here, this is for GBP USD, uh, you take, your stop loss should be 33, this is a long position, so 33000, that's your stop loss, right? 63 pips down. And your take profit, your take profit, you don't really need to change it, but let's assume that you want uh, 34000. Then you here change your uh, risk reward to 2%, and as you can see, your lot size should be 0 0.01. It's a micro lot. So it's as simple as that. In this specific, as you can see, it's showing right here the take profit and the stop loss level. And uh, you can play around with it depending on your pips or what's the stop loss that you should be looking for. Now, this it will take you a little bit more of time before you calculate the entry point and so on, but I guarantee you, that is going to save you thousands of dollars if you learn how to use it and uh, it will make it easier for you since you're trading with a MetaTrader 4 platform. Hey, so I hope you really enjoyed this video and if you did, make sure you smash the like button to support this YouTube channel. And if you have any questions, you can put them in the comment section below. I'll be glad to answer those comments as soon as I can. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you on the next one.